I went wonders with this character like last week, I think it was. And um, I found something that I've never like noticed before. That there's a pathway with one of Melania's uh, phase two attack things there. And I, I've never been up there. I mean, I went up there and there's nothing really good up there. But uh, yeah, the more you know. I guess that's uh, the fun fact of the day. I'm an idiot. Right. Melania.
I'm happy that I'm like getting a second phase more often. Like the last thing I want is like to do really well and then the next video is just like I don't even get like quarter of her health gone. Uh one quick question for you guys as well. I'm not saying that I'm gonna do this anytime soon, but what should we do after we beat Melania with a torch? Should we stick to I think the only boss that's left on this save would be the two dragons, you know, like a Flacidisax and the Lich Dragon. Wait. And also Mog, like proper Mog, who I think is immune to Frostbite, if I'm not mistaken. Or we could go to like Dark Souls 1, 2, 3, Bloodborne. Like, there's a few bosses in them games that I haven't actually beaten yet, like Medea with a torch, or from Dark Souls 3, or Lawrence with a torch in Bloodborne, which would be horrendous, but yeah, let me know. this. Yeah, I have no idea how to do that. If I just keep rolling, sometimes I'm alive. <laughs> that was not smart. That was a really not a smart move. Lock on! Lock on! <laughs> okay. Oh, that's a dance, of course. Okay. The worst thing about phase two. Is like if I lose, like the worst that could happen in phase one is she die, like I die when she has the exact same amount of health. Phase two, I could die and she'll have like a bit more health than. Oh, God, ah!